Hey everybody, Isola here with Flick Direct, and I have another great 4K Ultra HD review for you. Today we are discussing Furiosa, a Mad Max saga. And boy, does it not disappoint. So grab your popcorn, sit back, relax, and let's get this started. So I thought I'd start off with a brief synopsis for those of you who haven't seen the movie yet, which honestly, this is the perfect opportunity to get your hands on a copy and watch it. Anyway, the world as we know it no longer exists. It's just a vast wasteland. And we start off with a young Furiosa who has been kidnapped from the green place of many mothers. And who kidnaps her? Well, none other than the biker horde that is run by the warlord Dementis. Now they race throughout the wasteland and encounter Immortan Joe. And of course, you know, that doesn't go great. We watch these two tyrants fight for dominance. All the while, Furiosa is just trying to survive and find her way home. Overall, this is a very entertaining movie. You have a lot of action and suspense, some thrilling scenes and really cool stunts. And of course, you have a great cast, two of whom is Anya Taylor-Joy and Chris Hemsworth. And at first, for a brief second, when I first saw the trailer, I honestly didn't realize it was Chris Hemsworth. But after that first second, you can see that it's actually him. I think this movie is great because you're getting an origin story, and we all love origin stories. They're really helpful to kind of give that background of the characters. And so this does really help give what you need for all the other movies that we have had in the past. Now the movie does tend to be a tiny bit slow in areas and I feel like a lot of the action was kind of thrown in there to kind of fill those gaps, but again, it's still a good story. So overall, I'm going to give this movie a three and a half out of five. Okay, now let's move on to the audio and visuals because that's the most important part of these DVD releases. Furiosa, A Mad Max Saga is of course 4K Ultra HD, presented in Dolby Vision, enhanced 2160p UHD, and of course filmed in widescreen. The image is highly stylized and just beautifully saturated in deep inky colors. And the way the scenes are digitally tinted is stunning. The images are crisp with detail and textures. Um, the wide shots are brilliantly shot, showing the gorgeous vistas with depth and clarity. Even if you aren't a fan of the franchise, the stunning quality of this video will make you want to watch this over and over again. And like I said, anytime the video quality is great, you're really just going to love the movie even more. And because of this, I'm going to give the video quality of Furiosa, A Mad Max Saga, a five out of five. Now on to the audio. The Dolby Atmos tracks never disappoint, and this is no exception. The sound is so crisp and clean. The roars of the vehicles can be felt throughout your body. It's just crazy. The sounds of the battle cries and the explosions really make you feel like you're there with the war boys, which is kind of scary if you think about it. And the way that the sound can make you focus on how ominous Immortan Joe's voice is really sh sends shivers down your spine. Honestly, my words won't do this justice. I don't think I can convince you. So you're honestly going to have to watch this for yourself. It's truly amazing what they can do with audio these days and I really think you're going to enjoy it. So with that, I give the audio a 5 out of 5. Now you may be asking yourself, what do I get with the 4K Ultra HD DVD? Well let me tell you. Of course you get a digital copy so you can watch it at home. Now you're also going to get extras like Highway to Valhalla, Pursuit of Furiosa, which is almost an hour long. This video takes you on an in-depth journey behind the scenes, and it's probably the best of the extras, 
You also get Stowaway to Nowhere, Metal Beasts and Holy Motors, Darkest Angel with Anya Taylor-Joy as Furiosa, of course, and Motorbike Messiah with Chris Hemsworth as Dementis. The extras are good, but I just feel they're a little lacking. I just wanted more, like maybe bloopers or outtakes. I mean, I know the movie is serious, but you know with this cast, they just had way too much fun and it couldn't have just been all seriousness. So with that, I give the extras a three out of five. Overall, I give Furiosa, A Mad Max Saga in 4K UHD a four out of five. The overall quality is really great. The video and audio is amazing. Like I said, crisp and clean, and you really feel like you're there in the wasteland, which again, I hope that never happens. I don't wanna be there. Again, also, I would say that where there are some things that are lacking, the overall audio and video quality do make up for it. So I really think that you're going to enjoy owning this copy of the movie. I also recommend getting copies of movies and owning the hard copies because even though you can watch a lot of these on streaming services, you never know when they're going to disappear. Whether it's a licensing issue or they just don't want to show it on their apps anymore, you could lose a lot of these really good movies. So I highly recommend setting your alarm clocks for tomorrow, August 13th, and getting your copy of Furiosa, A Mad Max Saga in Ultra 4K UHD. You can get this at your local stores or even online like Amazon, Best Buy. Again, I really feel like everybody should be owning the DVDs still because again, you don't know when they're gonna go away. And if you are a Mad Max fan, you should add this to your collection. And with that, this concludes my review of Furiosa, A Mad Max Saga in 4K Ultra UHD. I hope you enjoyed this and please be sure to like and subscribe to all of our channels so you don't miss any entertainment news. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.